What's meth psychosis like? Meth psychosis is basically when you're out of your mind, when your mind's playing tricks on you. When a person does a lot of meth, they stay up for long, long hours and days, and they're pretty much sleep deprived, and they're malnourished, and their brain chemistry can be affected by the meth in many different ways. Some people can handle their meth, and some people just can't. Meth psychosis is when they start to hear voices, when they start believing the voices, when they are hallucinating, when they're thinking that certain things are absolutely certain the way they are, although they, it's not really happening, but they are certain. Like they want to basically convince you this is happening and you have to believe it. A lot of people will start talking about the FBI or the CIA or certain agents that are after them. It's like as if they're like really committing federal crimes. Like who, who do you think you are that you're that important that the FBI is on to you? So psychosis can go in many different directions. People become, they have a meth-induced psychosis to the point where they've been up for so long that they're out of their minds and they're totally thinking that there's shadow people or there's people that are watching them or that the van down the street has FBI agents in it or different types of uh, police enforcement people that are out to get them. And sometimes they think that their best friends or their family members are out to get them. This is something that's very common with the meth world. Usually when I hear somebody talk about that, like the Secret Service, the FBI, the CIA are out to get them, the first thing I think is they're probably on meth. Not always. Sometimes they just have mental illness, but usually if you also couple mental illness with meth amphetamine addiction with a lot of people that, that like to do meth that actually have mental illness, then that happens a lot where they think that uh, they're paranoid. They're in a very paranoid state. And paranoia will destroy you. If you or somebody you know is struggling with meth and going through psychosis, please do not hesitate to reach out because I'm always here ready to talk to you and see how we can help you.